Hello and welcome back to Path of Exile. I'm back once again. Yes. I couldn't wait. Couldn't help it. So, we're gonna start off once again. Uh, we were on our way to the Mud Flats. Weren't we? I think we were. And as I logged in here, I was trying to check my l delay out. It seems fine. Like, it's, it's definitely not laggy or anything. I think there are quite a few people on the servers right now because I see the chat just booming. And I just spoke a bit to Mr. Froho. So, Mr. Froho... Very kind guy. Just got into the beta today and he's already level 11. Seriously, Froho? You've been playing a little bit too much, I think. So, I picked up a quest. Uh, the Mud Flats. Accidentally here. I didn't want to do that. But I'll let me go and pick it up again. So we can just have a look what it actually is. Um, it looks to me like they're still working a little bit on the quest system. Because you can't, you can't abandon quests or anything like that. But what I like is there's a nice flow to the quests at least. So it's sort of... Um, just it takes you through the quests area, of, uh, one area at a time. Each area has its own sort of little mini story going on, so that's that's pretty fun. So Tarkley, let's see. I spoke to him about Roas. Overgrown chickens with a murderous streak. That doesn't sound like Tarkley, does it? Wait, he's, he's it looks like a Scottish guy. Wait, let's have a look how he looks. Goodbye. <laughs> yes, yeah, so let's let's see. No, I don't have I don't know what's going on. Overgrown chickens with a murderous streak. They're easy enough to bring down, one by one. But don't get surrounded. Those talons of theirs will rip your innards out. They're a bit like magpies. Got an eye for what shines. If you get the chance, have a fossick around in their nests. Once they're dead, of course. Otherwise, they'll snap you up like a big fat worm. <laughs> Is that how you sound? I don't even know. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, okay. F serious now. I have to go look around their nests. Um, I've got a nice bow now, but I need to remove these gems. So split arrow, you're coming with me. Keen sting, I'm going to be using you now. So I can put split arrow in the armor. And I can put cold snap in the helmet. There we go. Ha! Oh. It's as if nothing's changed. Basalt band? Oh, that one's better. Go over there. Ooh, an un unidentified flask. Don't mind if I identify that. Stun recovery during recovery. Okay. How many charges does it have? 30. Oh, that's pretty much... Oh, wait, let's put that one at number one because it looks more important. Here we go. Good. Uh, that's it. I'm not going to buy anything else. I'm not going to do anything else here. i got two unidentified ones, but I feel I don't need to really identify them now. I mean, who cares? Who's around town? Let's have a look. Tigra. Medusa. Firo. Well, at least Jonathan is not here, because that guy, he's, he plays too much. Okay. So we're heading out. I'm just going to drop some items now, because I feel as if I really don't need them anymore. Destroy. Uh, 20, 21. Critical strike ratings, more on that one. No, it's the same. Attacks per second. Fire. Uh. Wow, that one's actually pretty good. That's fine, though. So, like, I'm, t I'm dropping items and destroying them because, you know, you don't, it didn't need to... Oops, I could have used that. Oh, goodness. It's not like you're really gonna need dodge. No, I don't need that either. Items, it's beta. Okay, so like the items and stuff, they don't really matter that much. Let's just keep that for now. Let's go. Mud flats. Oh, grand. We've been waiting for this. These rowers. <laughs> Seriously. Uh, what did I call them? Boar pigs? <laughs> no. Not boar pigs. Uh, pig birds. Oh. Okay, you're dead. You're gonna die. Oh, this is a good start. Killing stuff already. Stuff is dying quickly. Oh, cold snap time. Oh, I just love... Scroll of Wisdom! Oh, I need those. Oh, but I need more... There's a row nest right here! That just feels so lucky to me. Okay. I'm gonna go to that nest right now. Rustic Quiver. Why so shiny here? I do like. Okay, row a nest. Oh, no! They don't want me close to their nest. Oh! Cold snap! Get out of here. Get out. Get. I will. <laughs> uh, and I'll cold snap you. I love the spells. 
Oh. Come zombie. Do my pet in. Do you have a name? No. No names. Not a real pet, is he? Ah, it's a glyph. What? Investigate the mud flats for the purpose of the strange glyph. Hey! Don't attack my zombie like that. Okay. I shall find its purpose. Worry not, dear zombie. Oh, dear zombie, you've died! Swap stalkers. Get... I... Uh, uh... Oh, wow. <laughs> Double arrow ownage? Uh. That's fine. I'll get better with doing the voices, by the way, because I don't even know what I'm doing. Um... Oh, oh, I just thought I'd say that now because I'm pretty embarrassed. So I had some questions from, uh, I think it was Runeclaw. Runeclaw asked, um, does it matter where you put the gems? As far as I can tell, it doesn't matter. I'm not sure if later you get better slots or I think you get something like linked slots. But right now, you can just throw them pretty much anywhere as long as the gem fits the socket. Then he also asked, um, where do you get life and mana from? That's a pretty simple one as far as I can tell. You get it from stats. Um, I'll show you in the character screen in just a second here. I just thought I'd answer the, f the questions that I do get, because I will answer them in the comments anyway, but I thought I'd answer them right now so everyone else can see. It tells you here, get out of here zombies, that 118 extra life from your base stats and plus 21 from the gloves you are wearing. So it's pretty clear um, where you get it. It says plus 4 level from your base stats and plus 4 from base stats. Basically, um, it tells you exactly where it comes from. Stats, items pretty normal there's no you don't actually you can see you don't actually have a, a vitality stat so um, I'm assuming that that they all just give you a little bit I'm, I'm gonna guess that strength gives you a little bit more than the others I don't even know really but something like that <laughs> you just charged into a tree oh swamp stalker you must feel like a right fool everyone that watches this video is gonna see that rusted sword that's not gonna help I should actually equip a sword and just have that doesn't look like a glyph that looks like just like a screw or something. I'm gonna get a sword quickly, just equip it. Can I? I think I can. Okay, there. And just have a, a swing with it. Oh! Oh! Why not? I mean, just to test it out. That's very rusted, isn't it? Uh, get out of here. That's a baby one! Oh! It's small. Oh, this is not. This is not how I should be rolling. <laughs> No, back to the bow. Lumen was not cut out for this. And I'll drop this sword, I don't want this. Okay, so if you drop items in town, they get destroyed, but you can actually drop them here. So that's gonna make uh, adventuring a little bit easier, I think. You know, so you don't actually have to uh, worry about trading. You can just drop items if, if a friend wants them or whatever. Oh, pretty waterfall. Okay, we gotta find more rower nests, and we gotta find out what those glyphs do. Goodness. Get out of here. I want to kill you all. Oh, I'm missing. <laughs> I, was, I was missing. No need to keep the map open all the time. Gloss shard. Damn, it must hurt to be stabbed by a gloss. I don't even want to think about that. Oh! Lost boss in Act 1. Don't spoil it for me, little eye man. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's a wagon wheel here. Oh, shame. Someone didn't make it. Get oh, that's a big... Oh, that's a normal row. Never mind. Oh, one of the rows just dis disappeared. Was it you? Are you the one of these? Oh, I leveled. Okay, 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 okay. What? What's a nailed fist? Oh, <laughs> that's primitive. Okay, I'm not going to use that. It's like a plank with nails on it. Okay. Now. Ooh, wow. Projectile damage. Accuracy rating. I feel as if I should go for this one. There. Just so that I can go straight and get the- I'll get the passive, the ones on the sides later. Did someone say something in here? Oh no, go away! Marvel is the first challenge in the game, I don't want to see that. I thought that guy on the beach was a ch bit of a challenge, wasn't he? I don't know. A little bit. I mean, I, I had that super imbalanced wand when I fought him, but... <laughs> but hey. Who cares? Oh, shame, these corpses everywhere. Ooh, portal scroll. Oh, we, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna definitely test the portals. I wanna see what a portal looks like. I'm assuming it's a town portal. Hold on. Yes, to create a portal to town. Okay. I wanna see what they look like. That could be exciting. I'm not reading the chat, by the way. 
Someone asked me about a level 50 zone or something. I don't read the chat very much. I'm too busy concentrating on all the cool stuff that's happening on my screen. <laughs> oh, I apologize. It's fine. I don't think you mind. Zombie. Go drip somewhere else. I should raise more zombies, actually, thinking about it. Oh, that's a disgusting sound. Good, but disgusting. I hear a scuffle going on. That zombie is really going at it. Oh! Zombie. The zombie got taken out quickly, didn't he? Oh, shame. Hey, that guy's totally frozen. Shame, buddy. There. Oh, it's a woman. Oh, I gotta get out of here. That's grizzly. Okay. Oh, there's, there's another Ronest. Another glyph. How many of these do I need? Okay, we've got a corpse. Oh no, there's a lot of mobs here. This is such a good combo. Cold snap and archery. I wonder what other skills one can get. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, 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 ah! What the hell's that? Who's back? Bloom. Oh no. Get out of here. I'm scared of this guy. Increased dam- 65% increased damage. Oh goodness, I'm staying away from him. I'll kite him. I've played Hunter in a while. Oh no! I'm bad at kiting. I didn't play Hunter very well. I didn't say that, did I? <laughs> Cloth gloves. Okay, he's down. I'm sorry. But he's dead. That was a big one. Come, zombie. Let's go. I'm not much of a necromancer, so, like, don't expect me to use that zombie skill very much. I'm probably gonna get rid of it later if I can replace it with something cooler. But, um, yeah, it's just. It, it's not my thing. I don't like having zombies follow me. It un unnerves me. Okay, so we've got. How many. Hold on just a smidget. Oh, okay, they're three different glyphs. Ah. Oh, we're back at the waypoint. No, 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 no. This won't do. We're adventuring. Okay, get out of here. I'll kill you. Get far away from that waypoint. The further away, the better. The more dangerous it'll become. Ring mail. That sounds like. Hey! Okay, and another question that was that I asked in the previous episode that someone actually answered for me. I think it was. I'm trying to remember now. I can't remember. Sorry. Um, sage, sage something. <laughs> sage. I'm sorry, sage. But he told me that the armor. You know, you can wear all the armor on all the classes. But obviously, some of it's just more aimed towards other classes. So when you start seeing more stats on on the, on the armor later on, then you'll see that some armor, like for instance, probably leather and ringmail or chainmail or whatever, um, will probably be more aimed towards classes like this, uh, the the ranger or the duelist maybe. Um, where plate will probably be more aimed towards the, the melee classes. You know, it makes sense. Okay, it makes sense. And then cloth, obviously, for the silly witch. What's in here? Oh! Oh no! That's strange glyph wall! Tidal pa- Oh no! I'm not gonna do that yet. Hold on. I'm gonna explore the rest of this place first. Take the glyphs to the wall. We'll do it. Most definitely do it. But it's not right now. Get up. I'm gonna kill you. That's it. Okay. <laughs> oh. I love the range that you can use here. Oh, it's so good. It stands so far away. At least I'm picking up more cur Ooh, more currency as I was saying it. Good. I gotta keep the map open and just have a look around. Wow. I'll cold snap you all. Some multi shots in there. I keep forgetting to drink potions. I gotta say the game hasn't been very difficult so far. But I think that all changes, like, a little bit later on. Ooh, ooh. Basalt, basalt band. I've got so many of those already. You're gonna die. I just love the fact that all my controls are actually on the mouse. It's, it's quite nice. Uh, well, all of them, I suppose. I've got Q to press here, but... Um, middle mouse button, right click, both cold snap and, and split arrow. Works very nicely. Okay, so... How much is this little to explore? I can't wait to get to that cave wall now. You're gonna die. Did he run into a tree? Shame these rowers. I don't know. I don't know if they totally compass mentors here. I think something's a little bit off with them. Maybe they're just flustered. I mean, sorry, oh jeez, I would be if someone came into my swamp and started killing my family. No, make myself feel bad now. Shame. Corpse. Show me your wares. <laughs> ah, corpse. The 
times we've shared. Oh, shame, it's that woman again. She's everywhere. Okay, we've cleared it out. Mud flats aren't that big. Uh, have we cleared it out? Yeah, that's it. Good. Wait, I hear some zombies over here. Aha. Are these just respawns? Oh, anyway. Doesn't matter. We're done. Wow. I can't wait to do that stuff on the rune wall. This is going to be good. Wait, what is this here? Let's just look at the title passage first. You must find a way to lower the water. Oh, well, that's just, that's probably this. The title passage is now open. Speak to Tarkley for your reward. Oh. Okay, let's take a town portal. I want to speak to him. Oh! Wow. That's very blue. It's a bit black too, but it's got a lot of blue in it. Okay, town portal. Oh, cool. It's out here. Oh, no. I have to walk past this grisly scene again. Hey, geezer. What's up? Medusa. Hello. Rerar. Hassie. Hi. Hi, Hassie. Tarkley. This is a placeholder quest text. As a reward for opening the title passage, you can take a skill gem. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hmm. Ah. Well, uh, dual strike. Mm, that's not going to help me very much. That sounded more like Tarkley's voice, doesn't it? I mean, I think so. Although I don't think he said anything about a placeholder. Ah, there's a Roa hanging here. <laughs> hey, Roa. Hmm. Okay. What? Oh, claw or sword. I was going to take Viper Strike, but that doesn't help at all. Okay, I'm going to take Elemental Hit, seeing that that's the only one that I can actually still use here. Thank you, Tarkley. Thank you. Nessa, I've actually said all... I've looked at all these already. Um... What? What's Mervale? Oh. Anyway, we'll, we'll get to that later. Strange Glyphs. Oh, that's the placeholder quest text. Okay, now... Uh, let's do some identifying. Increased armor? Nah. I can't sell yet, can I? No. Destroy. Cloth gloves? I'm not going to take those. Destroy. Greaves? Uh, why not? Let's identify those. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, but I can't put that in there. Oh, it's raised zombie, though. Um... Yeah, I don't need raised zombie right now. It's nice and all, but I'll survive without it. I'd rather have more <laughs> rare drops than than raised. No, actually, I should probably use raised zombie. Damn it! Get out of your boots. I don't even like you. Um, scroll of wisdom. Evasion, mana regeneration. Ooh. Oh no! Go wait, 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 wait. I got an idea. Here, here, here. Um, there's one that can use it. Oh, that's just a normal visor. That doesn't help me one bit. This is tough. Okay, I'm not finding anything that I need here. Oh, well, I'm just going to keep my, s my current armor for now. Destroy. Well, he has one more grieve here. Hold on. Oh. Destroy. Uh, purchase items. And these ones, I don't need them either. Destroy. I'll rather just keep a clean inventory. How, how's my split arrows level 3? Oh, wow. I wonder what level it can go up to. Because that's pretty fun. I mean, I like I like leveling skills. Okay, okay. Wait, where do we get elemental hit? Great. W. Assault band. Okay, this is going to be good. Um. Ooh, ooh, wait, there's another... There are more virgin merchants vendors here, aren't there? You. Uh, purchase items. Oh, okay. Mm, I'm going to save my items for now. Yeah, okay. 
Oh, wow, that's a lot of stuff. <gasps> All this bow stuff. Archer's Pendant of the Inuit. I should probably take that. I mean, I am an archer. Hmm. <laughs> I can't resist. I'm buying it. Wait. Thank you. That's it. I feel so much stronger already. Now, is there any quest to pick up here? I'm pretty sure that when I enter the title passage, things are just going to start happening, aren't they? Um, I mean, I expect them to. Okay, so. I think that's probably going to be this for that, of uh, this, it, not this. It's probably going to be it for this episode. What I'm going to do is I'm going to have another one out soon after this one. So you're going to get like a double dose today, today, hopefully. Hopefully. If all goes well. So, thanks for watching. Check back here soon for more. I still don't have any friends. Don't even talk about it. Um, I should add Mr. Froho to my friends because he spoke to me. <laughs> That's how desperate I am right now. Um, thanks for watching. Check back here soon for more. I'll probably uh, head into the title passage, do some exciting stuff there in the next episode. Hopefully we can do some more voices because I'm enjoying that right now. <laughs> oh, great. Okay. So that's it. Thanks for all the comments, by the way. I'm absolutely loving it. And most importantly, happy... Oh, shame. Happy plundering the Roa nests.